Hello again, welcome back to me, myself, and I playing The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. I play games so you don't have to. Let's have a Lilith run. This is our daily run. Ah, uh, where are we going? We're going all the way. So we don't need to worry about that stupid self-sacrifice pollux. I have forgotten what it's like not to have chocolate milk, which is a charge shot. And what you end up doing with chocolate milk is pressing the arrow key very, very fast in very quick succession in order to fire as fast as you possibly can. And now I've switched back to just hold the button down and you will fire anyway. This is a, a bit of a culture shock sort of thing. Um, I've been pressing the arrow button as fast as I possibly can in order to beat Megastan. Look, yeah, you better jump out of there. And, uh, it, yeah, well, no Mega Satan on this run, which is nice, but we do have to survive all the way to what I assume to be the chest. I hope it's the chest. Um, because it's a lot more interesting than the dark room, I guess. But all those extra items, it's a potential for a lot of extra items, or from those chests that do drop. If we had a, uh, a bomb, I could press the button. I had no bomb. I cannot press the button. Nothing makes me sadder than the fact I can't press that button right now. That was close. Uh, and that thing is in there, but that's okay. Yeah, cool. So it's a Lilith. A Lilith run. With Lilith, we press this spacebar whenever we feel like shooting twice as fast. Uh, which means boss rush is going to be great fun, but Hush is of course going to be insanely dull, as it usually is. But if we don't do them, we don't compete. So we have to. Sorry. Last time we did the daily, we didn't make it to boss rush, I think. Because I slow down. I always slow down. I think I have more time than I do. And I don't. Ah, that's a good... It's a very good uh, upgrade. Damage and range. Synth oil, of course, is a syringe. And three syringes gives you spun, which is a plus two damage upgrade, I think. We've already had a decent damage upgrade just to start the game off. Uh, the range is not such a huge deal, but it can be on large rooms like the hush fight. Because you can stand a lot further back. But that's, that's in the future. For now, we will not walk into spikes. If we can avoid it, we'll try and get rid of these things before they charge us. It picked up Aquarius and I didn't even mention it. I think I chose Aquarius. Oh no, we did do boss rush before because I chose Aquarius. Semi-arbitrarily? Uh, just, just start boss rush, I think. It, it just leaves this trail behind you. Now I'm not sure. It calls itself a trail of tears. I'm not sure whether it actually synergizes with your tears. Um, so, that would be cool. Like, if you have a tear effect, does the trail of tears have that effect? E.g. poison poison damage? Uh, I'm, I'm not a fan of this. How do I get my incubus to shoot these things? And these fuckers that run away from you, just stop it, you. Yeah? Just get in here and fight. Fucking... You're not doing your job. I'm pretty sure you were put here to scare me out of this dungeon, and yet all you're doing is running away from me. Jackass. This seems like a good idea, uh, a good opportunity to double our, inc oh, I got hit. Double our incubuses. <laughs> and I didn't need to because all I needed to do was get hit once and clear the entire room. Uh, I wasn't intending to get hit once, but to be honest, it sped us up, didn't it? That's, a, that's the sort of room that can really slow you down with all the ducking and diving you have to do. Pretty glad that it was over quickly. It does. It may actually give us an advantage, and I'm not kidding here. An advantage that other people won't have. Ah. Many people may have got hit on that room, let's be fair. But. Many people may not have, and that's the, uh, that's the important set of people. The people who are trying not to get hit. They won't have taken the damage penalty, but they will be going slower than us. Also, I haven't found the item ring yet. Uh, Super Bandage is pretty good. It allows us to take a deal from in here, which I do want to take. Lord of the Pit. There are better ways of getting flight from the devil. But there are worse ways, and now at least we have precedent. Precedents, precedents that can fly out of the Air Force One, I suppose. Uh, having the precedent is important, because a lot more good items come from devil rooms than angel rooms, that's for sure. Having flight is important, because it means we can get things like the the thing on the... Pre oh, we did come in here. We can get this, which is kind of nice. I like it. And we can go into here, which will will be a bit slower, I think, than we would otherwise have been, which is true of anything that costs you time to do. So maybe that wasn't a particularly valuable observation to make. I don't know. Shit, what the fuck is this fucking dingle? 
And what am I shooting from? <laughs> Forgotten about incubuses. Right, it goes really fast, but it does it only once, so there's just that. Yikes. And then there's going to be another fucking champion fucking boss. It's taking forever, come on, die. And I've taken more damage than I should have, which is any at all. Just uh, let, yeah, follow me on my uh, trail of creep. Which is uh, just, it's one of the many new rides attractions in my new theme park. Which is going to be all about, you know, uncomfortable situations. Crossed with a sort of macabre horror movie feel. The trail of creep will be when you feel like you're being followed down a, a trail, but every time you turn around, there'll be nobody there. Uh, it's amazing. Can't wait to see it. We get flies if we shoot these, but I'm not going to because it takes time. Man, that was a shit room. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not happy to have done it. Oh, I'm happy to have finished doing it, if you see what I mean. I'm happy that it's done. I would very much like to get Sackhead here, but I don't think there's an opportunity because I don't know where we're going to get the money. As with all things, where do we get the money? Not there. Could be a secret room around here somewhere, but I don't have any bombs. Because the game is not giving me the items I need to progress well. So I guess we'll just go. Five, six minutes. Mm, could be faster. I don't think we really gained a, a huge amount of time from not getting... Well, from not, not getting hit on that room, I think. In fact, getting hit on that room has cost us... Just the uh, just the points and, and the survivability from being hit. Man, I've forgotten how to play Lilith. All this uh, trying to hit with the thing that's not in your face. Good. Oh, we really need some more HP, please, game. I would very much appreciate that. Hitting these things okay, though. That's good. This is where flight really comes into its own, because you don't want to be running around uh, the border of this room. Trying to hit these little jokers. Let's go in here. Oh, we can't even open them. It's a good thing I didn't press the spacebar. I was very much about to press the spacebar and go, yeah, let's fight this fucking room, and then discover that that's not an option. Uh, because <laughs> I can't open the chests. Well, consumable game is not great today. We've not had not had much luck in drops, really. I mean, I don't think I've misused them. I think it's just we haven't seen any. I'm not going to open those chests. Uh, I'd rather open... Oh, that one. Thank you. I'd rather open the item room. Or the shop. Probably the item room. The reason I use the... Uh, the charge on my, my box of friends just now. Oh, that was bad. Man, I hate these things. Quite a lot. <laughs> uh, these big rooms give us a full charge. Uh, half a charge. Two, two uh, pips on our charge. So I knew there were two big rooms, so I figured why not use them. Just, uh, you know, it's just a resource that you got to manage. And I am managing it as I please, so please stop questioning. Uh, I, I don't want this. I never remember which bean is a passive item, so I always end up taking them and then putting them back down again, because, Jesus Christ, what is this shit, you know what I mean? Hello? Uh, do we open this? Sure. We may get another key to open the other one. We've got Bob's brain. I might as well take it. Now we've got two. Two Bob's brains. And uh, no, we've still got one. I think Bob's brain hadn't spawned before I pressed the button. Maybe. Can you uh, please stay in a position where I can just hit you? Bob's brain is a very dangerous pickup. I've taken it before by accident. But this is the first time I've really taken it on purpose. I just want to see how well we do, really. It's got a huge opportunity to explode us. <laughs> it doesn't sound encouraging. It's not encouraging. Uh, if if it hits an enemy that's nearby, it's going to hurt. Oh, yeah. That's true. We're very slow. I've had the misfortune of going to every wrong room so far. I assume there's um, some sort of technique for figuring out which is the most likely way to go, but bugger if I know what it is. Try to get as many of these as we can in one explosion. We can also sort of camp out here like noobs. Avoid the issue entirely just by not being on the ground. That seems like a good idea. We've got 10 cents still. Haven't found a single extra cent. We don't even have fucking... What's the matter with me? I could at least have recharged my item. Can I? No, maybe I couldn't. I'd like to have <laughs> a little bit more fighting power against Chubb here. 
Oh, I missed. I want to hit Chub with Bob's brain. Bob's brain, Chub, go. No. Ah, oh, whatever. Fight's over. We get a deal with the devil. We don't, but we do get a nice uh, shot speed and damage upgrade. Which is... I think the damage upgrade is more valuable. I'd rather have a tears upgrade at this stage, but... Shot speed is not useless. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yes, okay. I will open one of them, and then come back if we can get a second one later. I hate this version of fucking Mega Malvo. Maybe energy resources. Wow, I, I completely failed to get hit. As if getting hit was the, the goal, yeah. yeah. Uh, can we talk about how I've only got one of each of my uh, familiars, even though I use my box of friends? Excuse me? Oh, I do have two, two uh, flies. But where's my other incubus? Oh, they're on top of each other. Alright, you fucking weirdos. Kind of prefer it when you stand apart a little bit, but okay. Oh, I dodged it and then walked into it anyway. That's that's how I play. That's me to a T. Dodged it, but walked into it anyway. This seems like a secret room. It's not a secret room. It seemed like a secret room. I didn't mean it was a secret room, you know? That was an excellent Bob's Brain. I mean, Bob's Brain is not useless, as you can see from stunts like that, but I am useless, as you can see from stunts like that. What do we do here, though? Oh, thank you. Two of Hearts could be useful if we ever get HP. Not looking likely. Super Bandage is already gone because we spent it on flight. So we're basically rolling on Spirit Hearts, which basically makes us Blue Baby, and I know how much I hate Blue Baby for the fact that you can't take HP, but at least when we do get an HP upgrade, it's, you know, useful to us. Help, help. How did I get hit twice? What's happening here? We uh, hope there's a Spirit Heart in this shop. Please hit. Thank you. Uh, no, actually, there's a Greed fight, so let's just die now and have them move. Please, just get out of my way. Greed. <sighs> have a breath for the entire fight, because I am one hit away from death. And I've got Bob's brain. Not a good situation. That's a good situation. If you can get a decent Bob's brain shot, then Bob's brain becomes really, really valuable. Uh, but until then, Bob's brain is a massive liability. Uh, so I, I took it. You know, it makes sense, right? Massive liability, you should probably take it. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, how about your impending doom? Eh. Potato, potato, right? You say impending doom, I say, you know, doomsday device. It will, it will vanquish all my foes with great aplomb and prejudice. Bob's brain is back. Hit that thing with it. Hit. Okay, hit that thing with it. Try not to dodge into the explosions from these things. You do it every time. See, when they play chicken like that, and you don't know if you're going to kill them before they walk into you, and then you do kill them before they walk into you, but by that time you've decided that you know, you're going to lose. So you dodge, and then you dodge into the explosion instead. You can't win! Right. False brain, get down there and hit anything. Yeah, good. And my creep will at least do a decent amount of damage to them, so I guess there is that. Aquarius is not valueless. It's just not great. For fuck's sake. Send me on wild goose chases again. I'm looking for the item room. Uh, that's not an item room. That's a self-sacrifice room. We don't need that on this run game, so we just sort of not, not have it. Mm -hmm. We could go into the double key room. I would like a bomb. We've got plenty of money now, so we could... Uh, but <laughs> that's because we fought greed in the shop. Now I can't buy anything. Look. <sighs> Calm down. You know, it's, it's not worth the... It's not worth the blood pressure. What's in here? Uh, three chests. With plenty of money in. Let's take the pill. Luck down. Well, that was already bad luck. So now I've got worse luck. Uh, I would like this. Come on, let's go. Man, this is taking forever. Look how slow we are. Despite having bat wings. Wings of wrath. We haven't even fought the boss. It's only Gertie. Don't get hit. I got hit. I'm so slow, I can't get past fucking Gertie's fucking shots. That was bullshit. I call bullshit. That was a shit run. Everybody who played that run, you're shit too. Okay, I'm just joking. Well, thank you for watching. I did really badly. I guess I'll try again tomorrow. See you then.